Hello there. Um, today we're going to go to a very specific area of the uh, upper section of the Colbertdale Valley, uh, an area known as the Colbertdale Arboretum. Um, not many people know it, which is a tragedy really, and it probably isn't given the attention it needs uh, in terms of maintenance. Um, but I'll turn the camera around, I don't know if it's going to work. Um, it's actually, you can see the Derby house in the middle of the picture there, I'll try and zoom in. But the area above, above and behind it, which is, I'm my fingers somewhere in this shot. Uh, hang on, oh, here we go. There, above it, there, um, is the Colbertdale Arboretum. It goes all the way from behind the Derby houses there, all the way up to the top of what we know is the Whaleback. Um, well, nearly to the top. And it's quite a special place. Um, we'll, we'll stroll from here over there and uh, introduce you. So there are a number of places to park and uh, ways to get into the Carbondale Arboretum, which is immediately behind me up on the hill there. Um, but I've started uh, most walks from this car park at the Coke Hearth, uh, which is the Carbondale Community Centre. So I see no reason to, to change. So we'll walk from here um, round to the Cinder Hill picnic area, play area, and go from there. Actually I've changed my mind. We're going to go up in front of the Derby houses, which seems uh, probably more appropriate. Actually this is uh, worthy of mention. This here used to be a, well used to be topped with a, a huge cast iron plinth. And this is where the ladies of uh, the Derby family used to come down uh, in their rather large dresses and uh, alight the carriages which came out of on the other side of this uh, camper van the, uh, the old um, coach houses it's a real shame it was stolen probably about seven or eight years ago now um, part of our heritage melted down for something or other but um, you can see again on top here you can see the groove where there were once some railings probably uh, removed during the war for the war effort but there was a lot of uh, items that were removed elsewhere in the country that were saved here but sadly that one has been stolen more recently than that for selfish reasons it's such an incredible shame for ages i don't think it would take too much to repair it but unfortunately the iron bridge gorge museum trust are uh, cash strapped and there are more pressing maintenance issues uh, on their uh, in their portfolio hoping that this may well change but uh, there's another one over here that's been like that for very very long and this of course is the old coach house specific for the, uh, the derby houses absolutely beautiful but essentially at this point in time unused